Okay, here we go for our next example. Finding the HCF or the LCM using the continuous division. Okay, now I have here a problem. Find the HCF or the LCM of 10, 36, and 56. This time there are three numbers involved. How are we going to apply this method, continuous division, in finding the HCF or the LCM of three numbers? Here we go. First, we have to work on the HCF first, okay? Look at this, the method here, this, the continuous divisions. I have started with two, 10, 36, and 56, since they are even numbers. So basically, this is divisible by two. So you have here 10, and then five, and then 18 divided by, 36 divided by two, 18, 56 divided by two, you have 28. Now, the next thing is highest common factor, okay? 5, 18, 28. So they don't have common anymore. Well, 18 and 28 has a common because they are both even and 5 is not an even number. But in highest common factor, it must be common among the three numbers given. Okay? So take note of that. So in that case, since there is no more common among the three numbers, then our HCF, there's no common factor, so in other words, our HCF is 2, okay? So that is our highest common factor. Okay, guys, next one. On the other side, I'll show you here the process of doing the, a, the LCM, the least common multiple, okay? So first, I am just rewriting everything in HCF. Look at them, okay? So I'm rewriting everything, huh? Look at this. Now, the next thing here is we have to continue doing the process. There are three numbers involved. Yes, there is no more common among the three. But in LCM, we can do that. We can break the, the, the rules, okay? We can break the rules in finding out the LCM. We can continue if uh, both pair, or we can pair the numbers here. If, like, for example, 5 and 18, they don't have common. 18 and 28 has common, right? They have a common factor. Have common factors, I, I mean. to 18 and 28 have common factors. Okay, what do you think are the common factors of 20, 18 and 28? So, uh, start with 2, okay? We can still break it down. So, there you go. You have 2, and then... See, I, what happened now is I am just bringing down 5, okay? I'm bringing down 5, and then since 18 is divisible by 2, there you go, you have 9, and then 18, 28 divisible by 2, and then 14. So we didn't do anything with 5, we just bring it down. And then now let's compare. 5, 9 doesn't have common. 9 and 14 doesn't have common. 5 and 14 doesn't have a common. So it doesn't have a common factor. So if that's the case, we can stop there and we form letter L. See, that's letter L. In other words, that is our LCM. Then we multiply them. 2 times 2 times 2 times 5 times 9 times 14. So there you go. The product there is the LCM, the least common multiple. Okay? And that's all about HCF and LCM. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe my YouTube channel.